हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल फिजियो ट्रेंड्स लास्ट वीडियो वे डिस्कस्ड अबाउट ओटावा रूल्स फॉर एंकल एक्सरे एनालिसिस एंड दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस विद यू ऑल अबाउट दी ओटावा रूल्स फॉर नी एक्सरे एनालिसिस इफ यू हैव मिस दैट वीडियो डोंट वरी द लिंक आई हैव प्रोवाइडेड ओवर हियर फ्रॉम वेयर यू कैन डायरेक्टली गो एंड सी दैट वीडियो Now let's start with understanding what are the rules for knee X-ray analysis that we should follow and that almost all the physicians also follows. The first thing what we have to remember for knee X-ray analysis is that X-ray is required only in patients who have an acute knee injuries with one or more of the following. First one is age 55 years or older. now the reason behind this is what that mostly after the age of 55 there will be decalcification there will be starting of osteoporosis bone density reduces and because of that even the minute trauma can cause fracture injuries inside the bone so definitely after the age of 55 we should go for x ray analysis second point my dear friends is tenderness at the head of the fibula now normally fibula head of the fibula is not a part of weight bearing over the knee joint but whenever after the injury if there is tenderness over the head of the fibula that can signify that there is something wrong with the fibula and because of that patient is complaining of tenderness so that is why we should go for x ray analysis if such case is present third point over here is isolated tenderness of patella now we all know that if there is direct impact on the patella then definitely it can cause patella fracture and it will be tender only in the cases whenever the patella is injured isolatedly so that is why if this is the case we should definitely go for the x ray analysis the fourth point over here is inability to flex the knee greater than 90 degrees now my dear friends this happens whenever like if there is a trauma injury and patient tries to actively or passively perform knee flexion they are not able to perform that means there can be injury to meniscus there can be ligament injury as well as there can be condylar injury so in such cases definitely we should go go for x ray investigation and the fifth point my dear friend is again inability to bear weight both immediately and in the emergency department which is like minimum of four steps so if our patient is not able to weight bear on that particular affected side even for the four steps walking then we should definitely go for x ray analysis my dear friends apart from this also certain cases when we know that there is a degenerative changes in the bone present patient is not coming with the acute injury but they have continuous knee pain more than 1 month 2 months 3 months then we should again go for x ray analysis which is not there in the ottawa knee rules but we can follow that as well so if you like this information please do like share and subscribe to my channel physio trends and if you have anything else to say please do let me know in the comment section 